so you get injured. You come down, and at what point do you realize this is different than any other time I've ever come down on the ground? Um, I felt. I mean, I felt the injury right away. Obviously, I felt. Uh, I knew it was. It was severe. I didn't know that I had the artery injury until probably you know a couple minutes down the road where. I could start to feel that blood fill up in the in the bottom of my leg. I uh, started to lose a little bit of feeling, so that was kind of the point where I started to pick a little bit. And then do you hear anything? Because you're on the ground or you're being taken off uh, on a stretcher in the ambulance. What are you, what are you hearing at the time? Uh, you know, once they got me on the stretcher, I was kind of on the sideline. I, I kept hearing the crowd ooing and on because it kept replaying, uh, replaying the play. And, and showing the injury every time, so I could hear that. I was like, well, I didn't know they were reviewing it. Um, clearly, I, I see I, I have a touchdown, so I thought you know it was up, and we'd be kicking extra point. But they kept replaying it. Uh, I was pretty aware of everything. It was just um, you know as time went on, it was it was a little more urgent for me to get into uh, get into the hospital and get some care going. Do you think you were in shock at the time? You didn't even realize it. Yeah, because uh, immediately when it happened, I was fairly calm um, I remember sitting in the end zone talking to our head athletic trainer Nate Bresky and I was just told him to say hey man my knee's gone and he was like you sure like he, him and I he knows I know my body pretty well so uh, you know I was calm all the way up until the point we got back to the locker room and then uh, you know once that my leg started to feel the way it did um, the panic kind of started to set in for more Dan Patrick show tune to audience channel 239 on direct TV or download the Dan Patrick show app